Do you feel uncomfortable in your prominent position? Losing your balance. Cannot move in the harmony with your dance partner. In this video, we'll uncover the secrets to effortless and comfortable promenade position in ballroom. And secret number one. And secret number one of promenade position is the position between partners. What does it mean, position uh, between partners? In the close position, ladies' right sta side staying on the man's right side. Yes, that's a close position. When we change our position from close to promenade, lady moving slightly behind, and she stays in the man right side, and we are creating V-shape between our bodies. So what happens if we don't create this V-shape? So we're going to stay, maintain our close position, only open our face. And when we're going into prominent position, we don't really have a space between our legs. And we're going to kick each other and get in the space of each other. To create a great prominent position with the V shape between our body, we would like to show you one exercise. In the beginning of this exercise, we stay in front of each other, face to face, in the close position, let's say. Now, man going to open left foot 90 degrees to the left, and lady going to open right foot 90 degrees <clears throat> to the right. And we're going to open our face into prominent position. So we are creating V shape between our uh, bodies, between our hips. However, we keep in our upper body almost parallel. Now, if we're going to get to each other, yes, now Oksana going to stay in my right side and we're going to get the shape. And we're going to take step directly forward, man on the left foot, lady on the right. Now, we don't have problem between our legs and we can move simply and effortlessly into prominent position. And secret number two? And secret number two of prominent position is the direction of step in the prominent and contra prominent position. Step number one and step number two. When we're talking about prominent position, most of the people take step to the side, man on the left, lady on the right, or diagonal, forward, man to the right, to the left. And it's not really big problem with this step. But what is the next step? Can you see when I'm lowering, I'm going across and Aksana going across. We're going into the space of each other and definitely we cannot feel comfortable and it feels really, really hard. Now, what do we have to do instead? What is the direction? What we have to do instead, we have to take step forward and our feet must be parallel. My left foot moving under my left elbow and Aksana's right foot moving under her right elbow. If we're going to do it correctly, just very simple, we're going to take step, yes? Now we have no problem to take next step and get back, for example, in the close position. So, step number one of prominent position, very comfortable, and step number two, also very comfortable because we don't have conflict between our legs and feet. We don't have problem with the space of each other. And secret number three, head position for men. When we stay in the prominent position, ladies' head outside of the frame. But gentlemen, our face not outside of the frame. We are looking forward slightly to the right. Imagine like you have a watch on your left hand and you're looking through the watch. So 9.30 or 10 o'clock, your head position. One, two, and three. Very often I can see different picture when men try to stretch too much to the left. You can see I'm off the balance and it's moving my legs and hips into the ladies' space. So the secret to the comfortable and effortless prominent position. So it's a three point. Point number one, positions between partners. Point number two, step number one and step number two of prominent position. And finally, uh, tip number three, secret number three, correct head position for men.